what is a fire risk assessment? A fire risk assessment is a thorough inspection of premises which should be carried out by the building's responsible person. This inspection should be carried out thoroughly and regularly so that all fire safety measures are met. Carrying out a fire risk assessment consists of five steps. Identify any hazards. Identify any people at risk. Evaluate, remove or reduce the risks. Record your findings. Prepare an emergency plan and provide training. Review and update the fire risk assessment frequently. Identifying hazards. When identifying fire hazards in your premises, there are certain things that you need to look out for that could be classed as hazardous or which are likely to contribute to a fire hazard. In order to understand what may be a potential fire risk, it is important to understand that three elements must be present in order for a fire to start. These are oxygen, fuel and ignition. A fire risk can be eliminated by removing one or all three of these parts. People at risk. There may be specific individuals who are more at risk should a fire occur. Individuals who may be working in the vicinity of faster burning materials such as petrol and rubber are at a higher risk, therefore should be noted as relevant persons. Evaluating. Once you have recorded the potential risks in your environment and the persons who could be at risk in the event of a fire, you should then evaluate these risks and act accordingly to help minimise or eliminate risks. Record your findings. It is important to record all of your findings, from the initial risks that have been noted to the precautions you have taken to remove or minimise those risks. Review. Your environment changes over time, whether it is structural or the number of staff and visitors increasing. Therefore, you must adapt your fire safety precautions to accommodate for this change 